so long since I've done a video. It is crazy. I think I have a, a baby now, and he is 17 months old. Look how long it's been. And we've moved, and all kinds of craziness has been going on. But I am wanting, you know, I'm enjoying a lot of new makeup things. Well, not really new. This I've been using a lot. And I just wanted to share some of my favorites. So I know I'm very late for June. But I thought I would still share with you all what I've been enjoying. Um, and I did pretty much for the whole month of June. And I'm still enjoying this month. So to start things off, this isn't new to most people, beauty gurus, is the Sigma Flat Kabuki F80 brush. I love this to apply my foundation. Um, I just love it. I love the bristles. They're so soft and... I got this, I think, some maybe it's been a year and a half now that I've had this, and um, I clean it and keep it all nice and fluffy, and I just love how it applies. The next thing is that I've really been loving is the Reveal the Palette. Um, I really like this from Coastal Sense. It has all these beautiful colors in it, and you can just use them pretty much for every day. If you even wanted to go out and do more of a dramatic look, you've got all these darker colors over here. You can do and then these lighter ones up here it's just gorgeous i just love um they're real creamy buttery some of them are i love it so i was using it a lot in june and then for blush this is another one everyone talks about but i love it and it's the milani baked blush in luminoso it's just like the perfect pink peachy blush um i'm wearing it today so you can tell, like, right there. It's just, I don't know, it's pink, and it has, like, these little gold specks in it. It just looks so pretty, especially in the summer when you get a tan. It just looks great. Next I've been loving is this Age Rewinder by Maybelline. It's It erases dark circles, and it is in the brightener one. It just is great to put on. I just usually put it under my eye right here just to brighten my face up. Being a mom now, my goodness, I need to be brightened up at times. And this works great, and a lot of people use this, so I'm sure it's nothing new to a lot of you all. And then another thing I use a lot that everyone else talks about is um, the NYC Smooth and Bronzing Face Powder. I use it, as you can see, I've hit pan on it, and I just use this a lot. So just put right here to give me a little, and then put on my forehead and wipe kind of over to give me a little bit of a bronzer. I don't use it all the time, but like sometimes on the weekends, sometimes I'll do it when I go to work. Just to make me not look dead. I haven't been able to put any sunless tanner on or um, sit in the sun or whatever. But I've got a lot more sun lately because my, my sunless went out in the pool and I'll sit out there with him or get in with him pretty much because it's been in the 90s here. Next is, um, I don't use this a lot either, just every once in a while, but I use it a lot in June it seemed like. This is the Mary Lou Minizer. Um, highlight Highlighter by, um, is this Benefit? The balm, I'm sorry, it's the balm. I love this stuff. It's just so pretty. And I just love it. I actually haven't put any on it. I'm put some right here. Just put some right there to kind of give me a little bit of glow. Just see how that, I know I don't have the best light. I'm going to fix this, but um, just gives you a little bit of a glow for the day. And it doesn't look, make you look like you've got oil built up on there. But you, I mean, it doesn't take much at all. So I'm going to go and put some right here under my brow bone. And it's just a beautiful highlighter. I love that. Next is, I, I've been really liking this. It's Nevia's A Kiss of Shimmer. It's kind of, it's one of these. It's almost like a little, it almost reminds a little bit of Baby Lips by Maybelline. But it's really moisturizing. I love it. And it even gives you like a little bit of color. It's just real pretty. And it has like a little bit of shimmer in it. So it's just, it just feels so good. I sometimes even put it on at night. I'll keep it at work to apply it. But um, it's just by Nevia. And like I said, you just pull this off and twist her up And it's great. And then as for fragrances, this, I love, I love vanilla. Like anything vanilla, oops, I love. And this is by, oh my goodness, I completely forgot where this is from, and it's not, it doesn't say on here, oh my word, not Aeropostale, they have like, this best smelling candles, 
close. I could see it. I could see the store. I just can't remember. But anyway, this is a vanilla that I got from there for just this little bottle thing. It was ten dollars. So I don't use it a whole lot, but my goodness, it is. I mean, you can wear this. I think summer, spring, autumn, winter. This is. It just smells so good. I haven't put any on today. Mmm. Mmm. <sighs> And this is just a favorite that I've been using a lot. I think I wore it a lot in June. And I really like to apply it a lot, um, you know, before going to church. And a lot of people be like, you smell so sweet. I'm like, thanks. I sweat sweetness. Not really, but this is my little secret. I don't have to tell them, but I do because you can't lie. But anyway, that was all my favorites for June. Um, subscribe to me. I know I have not been on for the longest time, and I want to start making more videos. It's just tough sometimes, but I thought, you know, even if it's just favorites, I do something once a month and just share my favorites with you all. I will do that. So I hope you enjoyed this video. You have a great day. Bye.